What's up, Rockets? I'm John Gill. And I'm Nicholas Zamora. And this is the last senior produced J-Rocket TV broadcast for 2018. Our top story, Judson High School alum Spencer Baker recently competed on the hit NBC TV series, The Voice. While on The Voice, Spencer was coached by Blake Shelton, where she was able to make it to the Final Four. Unfortunately, Spencer didn't win. That honor went to Brian Cartelli, but Spencer may still end up pursuing a successful career in music, and we here at Judson High School wish her the best. In tech news, the Xbox team is creating a controller for the disabled. Details have been released on the first ever console controller designed and made specifically for disabled gamers. Microsoft says the adaptive controller will give people easier access to the games they love. Currently, players have to rely on the work of specialist charities to adapt traditional controllers to meet their needs. Last week, we showcased some music videos produced by Mr. B's AV production classes, and we asked you for your help in deciding which one was the best. The results are in, and the winner is... Beautiful. Congratulations, Serenity and Paige. To see the other music videos featured last week and a couple more that didn't quite make the final cut, make sure to check out our YouTube channel. And now to continue our spring showcase, here's a short film completed by Nick Bowers and Daniel Gill. All right, students, you are now late for class. We're conducting a tardy roundup. Please go to a tardy station to get a tardy pass. Hey, I think it was just a loose internet connection. All right. Nick, what's going on? I was late again. <sighs> Nick, you gotta work at this, man. If you're late one more time, you're not gonna be able to walk the stage. You're not gonna be able to graduate. Yeah, I just have a tight schedule. Okay, just please, get your act together, all right? Yes, sir. Okay, guys, today hey, we're Nick, going over... Hey, uh, Nick, I don't have a right to school tomorrow. And I know you drive. Uh, you Carolina think you'd give me one? Yeah, for sure, Brian. Nick, it's time for you to go to bed. One minute, Mom. I'm trying to finish the paper. God, it's already 8.25? I gotta go. Where are my clean shirts at? Damn, now I gotta find my keys? And now I have to pick up Brian? Are you kidding? Man, Brian, I'm sorry. I said it way too late last night finishing some papers. Hopefully we're not late today. Nick, calm down, man. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna make it. You're not gonna get that tardy. Brian, that was the minute belt. We have to walk all the way to the field. Hopefully they're not doing tardy roundups. They do tardy rounds every day. Brian, Brian, wait, we can't go in the front, there's a hall monitor. Oh, Nick, we can just go around the back. Oh, you're right, the Agui, let's go. Oh, Brian, look, so I put a rock in the door, bro. See, Ryan, I told you we're gonna be late. Now we gotta worry about the hall monitor catching us. Nick, watch out, there's a hall monitor right below you. Nick, that was close. Yeah, we almost got caught by the hall monitor. Now we have to go all the way to the P wing, and we're in the H wing still. Well, I think I saw the hall monitor going that way, so let's see what. Let's go. Where do you think you're going? Uh, to class. We're going to class. Oh no, you're not. 
Hey, you guys got the uh, stuff I asked for? Uh, yeah, we have the stuff. <laughs> Great. Let me get this straight, Mr. B. You, you know these boys? Are you serious? Yeah, I had them get some stuff for my lesson. I'm, I'm sorry. Are you serious? You boys got lucky. You won't be getting saved next time. Hey, thank you so much. Oh, so much. Yeah, thank you. Guys, what I tell you about getting late to class? Here's some passes, please. Get to class on time. That's it. Thank you, Mr. Don't mention it. Hey, bro, I get to graduate now. What's the matter with you? <laughs> what are you waiting for? <laughs> there is sound in the background. One minute, Mom. Wait, Dan, it's not moving. Wait, I'm supposed to be moving right now? Yeah, the whole scene is just me and you moving, and then oh. at this last part, you go in there. Let's see. Hey, uh, you guys got the stuff I needed? Next week, we have featured two more short films, so make sure you check out our next broadcast on Thursday. And now here's some senior updates. Hey seniors, next week's going to be a real busy week. On Monday, June 4th, we're going to have the Senior Olympics at the Relish Stadium at 8.35 a.m. Next day, Tuesday, June 5th, we're going to have the Elephant Walk. Try to get here by 8.15. The buses will be leaving at 9.15 to your older elementary and middle school campuses. When we get back that Tuesday, we'll have a senior panoramic photo taken in the parking lot. On Wednesday, June 6th, there'll be a practice for the graduation of the gymnasium from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. Immediately afterwards, will be our senior picnic at Live Oak Park. Big day, Thursday, June 7th, will be a mandatory graduation practice at the Alamo Dome from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. And that night, we'll have the graduation ceremony at 7 p.m. Afterwards, there'll be project graduation at Pedrotti's Ranch from 11 p.m. to 4.30 a.m. Let's stay focused, Rockets. We've got a lot to do next week. Back to you guys. And now, here's Quavon with this week's Word on the Street. If you could change anything about your last four years of your high school career, what would it be? Choose my friends wisely, bro. If you can change one thing about your high school career, what would it be? Uh, I'd probably actually do my work. Um, slight chance, class 2019. I'll change my grades because like, I know I suck, but I still suck right now. And I'm, I, almost, I almost didn't walk the stage. Maybe my junior year attendance because it was just 20s and 30s most. I'd probably actually go to school because DJ Rock hours are killing me, bro. <laughs> For real. DJ Rock hours are killing me. Throughout your whole high school career, what would you do differently? Um, Wednesday for basketball. I definitely would have joined J Rocket News. I would have been famous by now. I would have tried harder, try to get like a 3.7, 3.8. I got 3.6 right now. I wouldn't be lazy all four years. Throughout your whole high school career, what would you do differently? I wouldn't change a thing. This has been a great high school career. Not to have been slacking off so I can improve my GPA. I would have made a lot more friends throughout the years. Throughout your whole high school career, what would you do differently? Drop out. If you can change one thing about your high school career, what would it be? Nothing. I probably would have focused more on my skin so I could look prettier for the ladies and actually look decent in my life. 
I would definitely come to school more and I'll take it more serious. I wouldn't change anything like the great Branson once said because, you know, I love my life, but I definitely play basketball. I couldn't play because, you know, I had some problems freshman year and that carried to senior year. He was a thief. Yeah, I was a thief. Uh, my friends, I hung out with a lot of fake people. Uh, get homeschooled? Mm -hmm. Study more because, uh, you know, you don't study, you're going to fail three classes and almost not graduate. So don't be like Ricardo Medrano. Pass. Wow. Names. Names. Uh, I wouldn't have goofed off so much as a freshman and sophomore, and I would have stayed away from C's. I would change waiting to finish my credit career for the last minute. Actually study. Uh, I'd have to say study more. Uh, honestly, I think that's what hurts a lot of seniors in the end, because right now senioritis really kicks in. I mean, I'm pretty sure I had senioritis the first day of school. So <laughs> I would have more fun. My high school career was boring. But I would have also done my homework. Nothing. Um, I probably wouldn't tell anybody that it was the principal's daughter. Keep <laughs> it a secret until the very end. <laughs> well, that's about all the time we have today, Rockets. I'm John Gill. And I'm Nicholas Zamora. And this has been J Rocket TV. To see more of our content and other broadcasts, make sure to subscribe to our channel at youtube.com slash TV. And let's stay focused, Rockets. Seniors only have four more days until graduation.